Here's a great way to illustrate the importance of wearing safety glasses. I was in a meeting and what they did was, toward the end of the meeting, they had planned on this ahead of time and everything was set up. And the person leading the meeting knew what was going to happen. None of this was a surprise. In fact, they had to do the right thing to make sure it worked the best it could. At the end of the meeting, the person put on some safety glasses, or they had them on during the course of the meeting, but they, they put them on, or they made sure they had safety glasses with sad shields on them and the, the appropriate eyewear for that place. But in this case, the guy took a pair of safety glasses and put them on toward the end of his meeting. And he was mentioning that, you know, remember when you go back to the workplace that you've got your safety glasses on and the like. And as he's talking, partially out of the view from his side, somebody came walking in the room with a giant pie in their hand. Okay, so the pie, and by the way, the way you make the pie is get, get one of those pre-made pie crusts and then fill the whole thing with whipped cream. You fill it with whipped cream, Cool Whip, make sure it's a good, good solid amount. And that person came walking in and as he's wrapping the meeting up saying, okay, make, and making whatever announcements and he knows this is gonna happen. The person walks over to him, he turns slightly in their direction and they take the pie and hit him right in the face with the pie. And then all of a sudden, he's covered, his face totally covered with the whipped cream and everything else. You could use a pudding pie, whatever you want, and test these out ahead of time. Not a bad idea to know what the reaction is going to be. And so he's standing there with all this over his face, and then calmly, with a smile on his face, reaches up, takes the safety glasses, and takes them off. And there you could see his eyes completely clear of all the pie and everything else. And it was a beautiful lesson that those safety glasses protected his eyes. There was no debris or anything there. The side shields protected him. And he didn't have to say a lesson. He didn't have to say, by the way, that's why safety glasses are so important. Unconsciously, while everybody's laughing in hysterics about the pie getting hit in the face, the person getting hit in the face with the pie, the whole idea and the image is made clear when he takes the glasses off and they see his face. And that's one way you can have fun with it. Keep in mind, practice this ahead of time because the pie will cause debris to go in different directions. You don't want to damage equipment or other things around you. And you certainly don't want to hit any innocent bystanders that aren't part of the safety team and the presentation. Have a great time making safety fun. Another advantage of the pie gag is that this is once again a safety meeting people are going to go home and talk about. It multiplies your effectiveness. Imagine if every safety meeting you did, people would tell everybody they know about it. Hey, guess what we did at work today? And they tell that story. One of the things I can tell you that I learned when I studied hypnosis, and I studied it to learn about communication. One of the things I learned was that when people tell a story like that over and over again, it reinforces the learning with them. It strengthens what they learn. It helps them remember it, and it makes it more, gives it more strength and more power. So when you do safety meetings that are memorable, that people are going to talk about, I guarantee you that lesson sinks in. When I do safety meetings and do magic in my presentation, I do it to make the meeting fun. I do it to make it interesting. I teach while I'm doing the tricks. I make the patter around it. But it also makes it memorable. I know people are going to go home that day and talk about the magician they had at the safety meeting. And I know every time they talk about it, they're going to remember the points that I taught them. And that's what you want people doing with the ideas you teach them every single day. Don't miss out. Be sure to hit the red button on the lower right and subscribe. That way, every time we release a video, you'll be aware of it.